So in this problem, we're asked whether in the game of pool, when the cue ball strikes an object ball, if the two of them are not exactly lined up, whether the two balls will move off at a 90 degree angle. So in order to solve this, all we're going to do is draw a before and after picture, and then we're going to conserve momentum because the two balls are going to be an isolated system, um, and our answer will come out of that. So beforehand, before the collision, we have the cue ball moving up, with some velocity v naught, about to strike the object ball of mass m, which is stationary. After the collision, the two are going to move off. The object ball is going to move off with some speed big V, and the cue ball is going to move off with some speed v final. This vector sign should not be there. And so now, all we have to do is, like I said, uh, conserve momentum. Since the two form an isolated system, there are no net external forces acting upon them. We know that P initial equals P final, which tells us that M V naught equals M V final plus M big V, which tells us that V naught equals V final plus big V. So now all we're going to do is we're going to take the dot product of um, each of these sides with itself, uh, and I realize this is uh, somewhat of an unintuitive step, uh, but what this is going to do is this is going to give us um, an expression um, that contains v final dot of big V. And we're going to use that to uh, figure out the conditions for our answer. So if we take the dot product, we get v naught dot v naught is equal to v final plus big V dot v final plus big V. And since the dot product can distribute across sums, what this gives us is v naught dot v naught is equal to v final dot v final plus big V dot big V plus 2 v final dot big V. Now, if you remember when we were talking about dot products, um, the dot product of a vector with itself is actually just going to be the magnitude of that vector squared. And so we can um, substitute that in. And I'm actually also going to multiply by uh, 1 over 2 times m. And the reason for that is going to become um, apparent pretty quickly. So 1 over 2m times the magnitude of uh, velocity is just the speed. So the speed v naught squared equals 1 over 2m v final squared plus 1 over 2m big V squared plus m v final dotted with big V. So, um, looking at this equation, um, it should be pretty clear that these are all um, energy expressions. So this is the initial energy of the cue ball, and these are the final energies of the cue ball and the object ball. Um, and so since V final dotted with big V is going to be zero, if and only if uh, there is a 90 degree angle between them, uh, we know that the two balls are going to move off at a 90 degree angle, if and only if this is zero, and thus energy is conserved. So a cue ball and an object ball will move off at a 90 degree angle if the collision between the two balls is approximately elastic.